been montaging our birdhouses. Today is the final day, and today we are going to be sealing your birdhouse. You'll have a little kind of ketchup packet full of your montage outdoor. This is safe for kids to use, and I'll make sure that your outdoor birdhouse can stay there for a long time. When you're doing your birdhouse, make sure you have something under it to make sure no bodge podge gets on whatever you are working on. And we are going to be lifting it up for this project, so find anything that you really want um, to pull it up. Apply thin coat to birdhouse, clean brush, and soap and water. Apply your perch. Twist it in a small hole under this thing and then give it a few knocks with the hammer. And put Mod Podge on your perch as well. When the Mod Podge dries, it's clear, sticky, very sticky, but still very clear. Now, we're going to be using studs. You have a bag full of studs inside your kit. So, you're gonna choose your, some studs that you wanna use, and you can take it, put it on the roof, push it in, and then take a hammer that is not included with the kit, but we think you have at home. And then just hammer it on in there. And there you go. Steps in there. The last step is for a couple of days later. Make sure that your birdhouse is completely dry before you start the step. This step is not a kid's step, so grown-ups, you will need to be doing this for your kids. It's an adults-only acrylic sealer. You can only apply a thin coat. Thank you. Hello, everybody. I am so excited about this birdhouse. Isn't it beautiful? Stella worked super hard on it. And it, she built it, she nailed it, she painted it, she mod podged it, she put some of these really cool studs on the roof, and now it's time for the final step. Now the thing about this mod podge outdoor is that it's great for sealing in the color, but it's not, it's sticky. And I don't want our birds' little feathers to get stuck in the stickiness. So mod podge recommends that we put on an acrylic sealer about three to four days after uh, the birdhouse Mod Podge has dried. So to put on the acrylic sealer, it's adults only. You should try to do it outside so you have uh, a little bit of fresh air around you. You can use the same foam brush uh, that, that uh, they used for the Mod Podge. It's so easy. I mean, you literally just paint it on. Um, nice thin coat should do the trick. You could do two coats if you want to. I'm gonna paint right over these little um, studs that Stella pop popped on there. And like the Mod Podge, it'll go on and it'll be a little bit white at first, but when it dries, it'll be crystal clear. And that should get rid of all your tackiness. And then you are ready to put your birdhouse out. And I mean, lucky bird, right? That gets to live in this colorful creation. And this is the last project that we're doing together this summer in our summer kit. So I hope you had fun. I had fun. And if you'd like to sign up for more classes, uh, our fall classes are up and filling up. So get out, come on over to the website and fill it out. And I would love, love, love to see not only pictures of your birdhouse completed, 
but pictures of your birdhouse in your backyard or wherever you just you choose to put them. And if you get a special bird that moves in, send me a picture now to you. It's so exciting. All right, thank you so much, everybody. Stay safe, and I'll see you soon. Bye.